Yeah. Keep bringing keep bringing him up. Nestled up in between a little cave, uh, cove here. The uh, boys are in for a dive, and I am captain of the boat until the lobby gets back. Got the motor guide running because and I've just come to realize how much I really, really like the idea of uh, a Minn Kota. Definitely something I'm probably going to look into on my tinny. 
because anchors are terrible. Hate them. Already lost one the other episode, so I think it might be something to do. So where we are, I couldn't even tell you where we are to be really honest, but a fair bit of action on the sound. Oh, there's bombies all along here, the boys are in for a dive. You'll see where we are, put the drone shots up. Just taking it as, I might even move the boat a little bit more, go around their boat. Which is, it may look far to where they are right here but it's only like 10 meters away from us so i might go around the other side because the boys are drifting on the other side and uh see if we can get ourselves onto some fish i've seen some awesome bombies on there before so see how we go Tell you what, we are spoiled for choices here in Mackay. Look at this beach, goes all the way up. This is one of the campgrounds on the on the in a goldsmith group. There's some sort of weird structure on one of the islands near. I'm pretty sure we're near the campgrounds where you can stay, but I'm not sure if you guys can see in the background. There's like a I'll throw the drone up soon as the wind dies down a little bit, but I um. You can see a structure over there. Someone tell me what it is. It looks like you can camp there, but I'm not 100% sure. But anyway, we are just perched up. We've got pretty, pretty wild weather before. So we're just trying to um, give ourselves a bit of a break, just have a bit of a chill bit, wait for the wind to die down for the afternoon and just bring it in really. We're not really doing nothing too crazy. I wish I would've got that sweet lip on the camera, but I was just too slow with it once it hooked. I know I was playing games, really, we're playing games. Anyway, throw some shots up of where we are. It's gonna bring in the afternoon, let's do it. Bobby, where are we off to? Head back to IO Reef, I think. We dropped there at the start, got a couple of coral trout on the jig, and uh, Jaden got a nice tuna. So we'll go back and have another look and um, try to get them. This wind's picked up. As you look at my hat. <laughs> Holy. Lisa here. Oh my God. That's why we hid in the bay for a little bit, just to see if we can get a bit of a break from the wind. But I'm really hoping that this first spot, I'm doing my hat up as we speak. I'm really hoping that we can go back to this first spot. I didn't film much of it there because we we're just testing the waters of what we were doing. And it was my first time jigging too. So I didn't really want to film it because it would have looked shit. But um, yeah, now we're going back to that spot. See what we can do, see what we can... I really wish I caught that sweet lift on camera, eh? Yeah, nice, broken one, double Yeah, one. we've got two fish in the boat, so that's a win, I guess. You're right, you're right, just let him run for a bit. Get him up. He's on. Holy! That was just straight in. Bro. Straight in. Oh. Ah. Come down the back, come down the back. One, one, one. Holy, holy. Oh, nearly up, nearly up. I reckon it's gonna be a big GT. Holy. It is a good GT. Oh. This will be a PB, bro. Keep, keep it over this way. This is a PB. Hold this. This is a PB. Holy, my goodness, bro. Kid. Holy! Hold him. I'm just gonna get him off the, off this rock. You got him? Yep. How do I hold him? Just hold his tail like I got him. You got yep. him? Holy! Oh my goodness! That's the biggest fish I've ever caught, bro. <laughs> Holy man! That was a fight. Oh my goodness! That's a good banger. Holy! My arms are so <laughs> sore, man. Holy fuck! Oh my goodness! That is nuts, Nobby. <laughs> well that was like, that was like, 
straight up. As soon as it slapped the water, <laughs> bang! Slapped the water. It just was on, man. It was so on. <laughs> Holy, this thing is so heavy. <laughs> What do you got there, mate? Mate, that was a fight. That is seriously the biggest fish I've ever caught. Big GT banger, first cast. First, as soon as it slapped the water, bro. As soon as it slapped the water, it was on, eh? It was on. My, my, my heart is just pumping right now, bro. Oh, mate. Look how big it is. That's a I mean, That's the biggest fish, bro, I've ever caught. Holy. That's nice. Here we go. Just like pumped, eh? That was that was a big fish. That was a great first GT. <laughs> I am still on a massive high of um, catching my biggest fish ever. Nobody's in the same spot now. He's having a turn. He reckons he can see him bust up, busting up again. So Jaden and Big T, I haven't probably introduced them in the video yet, but they're in the other boat over there. I don't know if you can see them. Weather is absolute shit house. To be really honest, we're in a good part now, but um, yeah, we're stuck out here because, like I said in the start of the video, we had two options of, I guess, coming back if it got too rough and still being able to bring the boat in. But I think we just said, bugger it, we are going to stay out here till the next high tide, which is around 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock at night, which gives us nothing but time to fish. So I'm stoked. I've got a fish in the boat and I've caught the biggest fish that I've ever caught ever, so what else what else there is for me to do? Oh, that's a wrap for the rest of the day. What do you reckon, Nobby? Yeah, we'll have a look, mate. Bit of bait still in there. How good was that GT? That was a good GT, man. That was good a banger. good GT. And it fought hard and just went off like a train, eh? They're so powerful. I was, I was not ready for it, to say the least. I was not ready for it at all. It's like, as soon as the rod, as soon as the lure hit the water, it just snapped it, and I was on. I thought I got a snag. I thought it snagged it straight up, but not. Right up, everyone. That brings us to another episode. We end up punching it back to the boat ramp, which we couldn't really unload the boats because of the low tide. So I hope you enjoyed this one. Again, we're super stoked on the fish that I caught, and we're going to be doing more of this style of content coming up soon, so make sure you like and subscribe. See you later.